a six to one chance with Imco affirmation at 12 to one, along with Fishing Tackle and 16 to one bar there. Yeah, Polar orders and they break away and uh, Shadowland was a little bit slowly into its stride and uh, Bravefoot taking quite a keen hold but it's Capital Bond now that comes to take it up, Capital Bond the leader, the inheritance running next to the rail and uh, at this stage Bravefoot is settled back in about uh, fourth place. So as they race through the first two furlongs of this Stratton Parker maiden stakes, Capital Bond on the outside of uh, Bravefoot and then just in behind these comes Inco inf Information. Shadowland is one of the back markers and they race down towards the four. Tanigras is uh, up with the place, that's running next to the rails and uh, as they come to the halfway stage it's Tanigras that uh, goes into the lead. Tanigras the leader with Nan's boy on the outside showing second inheritance with a fight face. Capital Bond and now Bravefoot uh, uh, really striding out very well indeed, comes through to share the lead as they come down to the two. And it's Bravefoot on the outside of Tanigras and La Parit is in the leading three as well. A gap of three lengths then to Inheritance back in uh, fourth place with sea level staying on. They meet rising ground and Bravefoot uh, meets it well. He goes on by length and a half, but Tanigras is running next to the rails and keeping on well. From the rear, sea level is finishing to most effect, but Bravefoot has this. It's going to be a win for Dancing Brave. Sea level finishing fast, but Bravefoot beats sea level. Tanigras is third. Well, you can set 